guys, it's Kalea, and today we are going to be doing, well, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a Packers-inspired makeup look. So, right now, it's preseason for football, but week one is coming up pretty soon, and Packers' first game, I believe, is September 9th against the Bears, and if you know me, I am a... Packers fan. I love the Packers, so I hope they win this game because I have a friend. Their favorite team is the Bears, and let's just say that I really want Packers to win. So um, today we are going to be doing a Packers-inspired makeup look. This is very simple and easy. I already done my makeup, so we're just going to be doing the eyes and then a nice shade lipstick so i have a few eyeshadow palettes here um i have a lot of green so i'm going to try to pick the right green color so i have a few to pick from i will show you guys some of the greens i have so i have this green right here it's kind of like Almost the shade of the Packers color, so I can choose between this one. I also put it right there. I also have this green. Hold on, right here. It's a little bit lighter, so I don't think I'm gonna go for that one, but we'll see. Um, I also have this. This one's kind of. Oh wait, hold on. I have these two greens right here. This one, this one, I believe. This is kind of, this is a really nice shade. It looks very dark right here, but on the eyes, it's kind of a little bit lighter. And then I have this really nice green right here. Or I also have this green, but that's not the, that's like a blue green. So I'm probably not gonna go for that one. So what I'm gonna do, is I'm going to test these out before I put it on my eye. So I'm just going to take a little bit and just put it on my hand to kind of see the green. And I'm wearing a green shirt. It's kind of, I couldn't find my other green shirt, but it was more of like a Packers color. So I chose this green shirt. I also have a Packers kind of sweatshirt slash jersey, but it's really hot today and that's like too hot to wear so not gonna wear that this is really nice it's a nice green see it's like really nice it's like a shimmery green or or i have this green hold on Ooh, this one's nice right there that one's really nice i think i'm gonna I, i'm gonna need a lot of it but that one's really nice right there see Oops. Which one should I use? Or, or I have this one. Let me see. Hmm, okay. I know that's what I'm going to go for. Let me, um, my hands are kind of dirty. Okay. I have a napkin right here, so I'm going to wipe them with my napkin. Okay, they're still kind of messed up, but it's okay. So, I have my eyeshadow brush. First, we're gonna go in with kind of a base color so that everything mixes in good. So for my base color, I'm using this base. It's kind of like a nudish color base color. So I'm just gonna go with that. So I'm just gonna put that onto my eyes. Oops. Like this. See, it's like very light. Okay. In this video, I decided not to have my mirror just because I can show you guys how I am actually going to be doing this instead of just looking in the mirror the whole time. So this one, last video, I needed my mirror. This video, I don't need my mirror. Okay. Uh. Okay, so right here we're going to be doing a shimmery yellow, and then right here we're going to do a green. So, 
Okay, so for the yellow, I think I'm going to be doing kind of like a goldish yellow. So I have here this gold right there. Okay. So yeah, we're going to be doing that one. Or, hold on, or I could do, um, no, hold on, I'm trying to figure out. Yeah, we're going to go with the one I have, okay? So, I'm going to take this on the back. It's like, I got this, like, when I was, I had this for a while. Um, but, yeah, these were, these are all messed up. This, these are actually all blush, and this is contour and, like, eyebrow stuff. I don't really use it anymore. I just use the eyeshadow. So we're going to go in with this very pretty gold color. This green is so pretty too right here. Hold on. This green right here. Okay, right here. Let me show you. Oh, that's pretty. Hold on. Okay, we're going to get a little bit more. Okay. This is more of like a shimmery eyeshadow instead of just like a regular solid color eyeshadow. I um used to not wear eyeshadow because I did not with it well I do not like the way it looked when I did my makeup because I wasn't really good at eyeshadow. I'm not good now but I'm just like decent with it so yeah I'm not like I just started knowing how to do eyeshadow because before, I used to just wear, like, mascara and, like, blush and stuff. But I still don't wear, like, I still don't wear eyeshadow out just because I don't really have to. I mean, it's just, like, a preference. Unless, like, I'm, like, playing around with um, makeup from times I do it. But I normally don't wear, like bright eyeshadows out places. I just don't really have to, like, I don't really have to. Okay, now we're going to go in with the green. I liked, ooh, let's see. Hmm, a lot of greens here that I could do. I think I might do a few. Okay, I'm going to do this green right here. I'm just going to do a little bit at a time because this is very, very dark, as you can see. So. Oh, oh yeah, that's very, very dark. Look how dark that is. That is so dark. You're going to kind of blend it into the gold so it mixes. So it mixes well. I have this song stuck in my head. What is it called? I'm not going to sing it, but I could hum it, but you guys, you guys probably don't want to hear that. So I I just like I was listening to to Pandora today and I heard it. I heard it like before, but like I really like it and I haven't heard it for a while. But there's just one catchy phrase that I really like and I've literally been like humming it all day and I'm like wait why I've totally I'm like you know sometimes when you're like just humming and you're like you don't even know you are like it's sometimes that's how I am sometimes 
Okay, so that's done. It's, I like that actually. Okay, this is what it looks like. Okay, we're now we're gonna do the other eye. I want to wipe this off. Okay, wipe it off right there. I'll have to tell you guys a song. It's um, I I don't even know their name. I totally forgot. I'll have to maybe I remember it. You know, it always happens. So like, if I'm trying to tell my friend something, I'm like, I'm like trying to tell her something. I'm like, oh, wait, I forgot. I forgot. And then like after when I leave. Like, she's not in with me anymore. I remember. I'm like, oh, that's what I meant to tell her. It's, that always happens. Like, when you're thinking of something, you can't remember. But then when you're gone or, like, not thinking about it anymore, you, you like, remember. It's, like, really annoying. So, yeah. Ooh. Okay. This eye now. Yeah, I've been a Packers fan for ever since I was... 12 I think 11 or 12 my and the reason why is because I never really used to watch football really until my cousin Desmond Moses used to play for the Packers and that was my first football game that I went to was the Packers and that's when I kind of just since he was on the team I started watching Green Bay a lot more and that's how I kind of just like started liking the Packers and just started watching football in general when I was 12. My dad um watches a lot of football so my mom doesn't really watch football that much. She doesn't really care for it but um whenever my dad used to watch football he still does. Whenever he watches football I just watch it with them and then I started liking it, you know? So that's how I became a Packers fan because my cousin used to play for the Packers. And then he played for Kansas Chiefs for a while. Um, yeah. Okay, this one looks a little bit. I'm trying to. This looks a lot more better somehow. <laughs> okay, that's good. Now we're gonna go in with that green, which is, oh, this one. I, yeah, this one. Take off, okay. Yeah, I like Packers. Okay, so, oh, a little bit darker, hold on. This eye always seems to do better. I just, it's a lot easier for me to do my right eye. Um, okay. See, like, I just seem to like this one a lot more, hold on. Oh, okay. Now we're just gonna kind of blend that into the yellow a little bit, the goldish yellow color. And if you want me to do more inspired football looks, like if you want a, let's see what other, if you want a Atlanta Falcons inspired, if you're like a Falcons fan, I'll do that look, even though I don't really like the Falcons. I'll also do a makeup look for them, for it, for the football team. If you want me to. I might do more of these, just like more inspired football makeup looks. I just chose Green Bay because, like I told you guys, my favorite football team is Green Bay. So that's why I chose to do Green Bay. I also like... The Jaguars. But my all time favorite is Packers. So, and my eyes are green, so it kind of goes with it a little bit. Well, they're actually hazel, but sometimes they look green. When I was younger, my eyes used to like be, I think they were, they were like a grayish, bluish color. 
And then they turned into hazel and they just stayed hazel. Sometimes they turn green, like a really pretty green, like, like a light green. Right now they're hazel, as you can see. Sometimes if I'm wearing like a light green shirt, my eyes would turn like reflect off the shirt and be different colors sometimes. It's really cool actually. Yeah, but. My uncle and my mom also have hazel green eyes. My uncles are like lighter, like, like like a light, light green hazel. My moms are kind of like mine a little bit. But yeah. <laughs> okay. This needs to be darker. Hold on a second. I'm sorry. I'm just. I need to do this. Okay. Like I told you, I'm not a makeup artist, so it's not going to be perfect. So if you want to see a makeup artist do makeup, then look at that video. Because I'm not a perfect makeup artist. I'm just average. So now we're going to go back in with that goldish color and just go over, the, over this color. And kind of just mix those in. So it makes like... A mix effect not just green and yellow side by side okay yeah I like doing I think I like doing eyeshadow I've gotten better at it um yeah so now I wonder if I should attempt to do a winged eyeliner because <laughs> ooh, that's a that's another story I um I'm not so good with eyeliner. I mean, if I put tape right here, I could do it, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to do like liner. Ooh, ow. I'm just going to do liner, but not like a winged eyeliner. So okay. have my eyeliner here and let's see if I could do this without messing anything up. This is what I need my mirror for. You know what? There we go. It's a little baby eyeliner. <laughs> mm. Okay, that's, I like that, okay. I need to get some more of this. I forgot where I got this from, too. I got it from, like... Hmm. I got this? Oh, I got this when I went to Minnesota. That's where I got it. I'm like, where did I get this from? I didn't get it from Georgia. I got this when I went to Minnesota. Oh, my gosh. Ooh. Um... Hmm. I like this one because it's like a pencil, sort of. It's a lot easier. Okay. Time for the wing part. I, um... I need my mirror, but I don't feel like getting it, so I should have brought it just in case. But... Whoa! Whoa! so tiny 
Okay, hold on. I have like, see, that's how I want it, but that piece, hold on. I'm going to have to cover that piece and like, um, Okay, now I like this eye better. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, that's good. I'm trying to think if I should add eyelashes or not. Hmm. Yeah, well... Okay, so here I have eyelashes. These are like natural. Whoa. Hair okay, right there. Okay. They look like this. See? I'm trying to think if I should add them or not. I don't wear these. But I could still. I'm just going to kind of test them out to see if I would like them. Okay, yeah, we're going to put on some lashes today. So I have eyelash glue. I need some more of this glue, actually. So my, how I normally do it, I take a little bit and put it on my wrist. Like that. And I take my finger. And I take just a little bit. And I put it right, hold on, right there. And then you want it kind of tacky when you put it on, so you just let it dry for a few seconds. Just like a few, not like all the way dry, but just a little bit dry, okay? So. Should be good now. I'm not really good at putting eyelashes on, so we're just gonna do my best. I still have glue in my hand. Actually, it's better if I go like this, actually. We go perfect okay now take some more glue i need some more of this the first time i used this i opened it and so like sometimes they have like a little like it's like a needle thingy not a needle but it's like a little like sharp thing and you like basically poke it in this to open it and i got so scared guys because I opened it right and it was like hot in the car and I kind of left it in the car for like a few maybe only for an hour and I left it in the car and when I opened it for the first time it like the stuff the glue popped up in my eye and I was like oh no and it burned so bad so yeah careful when you open stuff like that because and this stuff is sticky like you know, it's glue, so, you know, it sticks. And I was like, I had to wash my eyes out really fast. 
Oh, so. <sighs> Wait, did I put this the right? Yeah. I think for my lipstick, I'm going to do like a nude color. Or I have a few that I could choose from. I might just do like a lip gloss. We'll see. All right, time for this eye. Stick, stick, stick. Okay, now we're done. Now, I want a little bit more of a yellow color, so I'm gonna go in with a very shimmery color. This one's really, really pretty. I like this one. This is my mom's, I think. Yeah, this is my mom's, but I'm gonna use it. I don't know where she got this from. I never seen this it says like it's b u x o m i don't know what that is but i like the color it's really pretty it looks like a highlight maybe it is highlight i don't know we're just gonna put a little let me try on my hand it's so pretty okay i'm gonna put a little bit right there just for a little bit more shimmer What about eyeliner? Oh, no, that's not, that's not being eyeliner. Okay. Now for highlight, I'm going to put a little bit of highlight. Let me use this. I think it is highlight. Oh, that's a lot. Okay, now we're going to put a little bit right here. And that's it. So now we're going to do lipstick. First, I'm going to line my lips with this lip liner. It's like a brown pink. So we're just going to line our lips with it. Very lightly. I think I got this from... Mac, maybe. You don't have to line your lips. But I am. Whoa. Okay, now I'm going to do... Um, I'm thinking of this one right here, or this one. You can tell I've used these a lot. Look at that. Like, they're normally up to here. I've used this so much. Or, yeah, I'm going to do that because the rest of the colors are kind of dark. And since this is already kind of, like, big and vibrant, I'm going to do like a light color. So I'm going to mix these. So on the top, I'm going to do this. What is this called? Runway Hit Retro Matte. Is that the name? Ret Runway Hit? I don't know. Okay, now on bottom, we're going to put this one. This one's called, the name came off, matte. It's, it's a matte color, though. Okay. Hmm. And that's it. So, should I add a gloss on top of it? 
Let's do, oh, no, no, no. I'm going to add this on top. This is really pretty. It's a little flower. Isn't that pretty? It has a flower in it. We're going to add that on top. And that's it. So I hope you guys like this Packers inspired makeup look. Ready for week one football season, Packers. Um, this is very simple, as you can see. It was very simple to do and very quick. So I hope you guys like it. If you want me to do more um, football inspired makeup looks, just comment down below. Um, we're going to do a finishing spray. I finally got this finishing spray down just to look like this, not up here. So That's it. Oh, it always gets in my eye. Oh, my. So, um, thank you guys for watching, and have a great day.